Hey, I'm Lisi, author of the Click series and the Alpha series, and my latest, I am very excited about it, it's called Monster High. Merston High is the name of the high school where my new series Monster High is set. And most of the students who go there think that they're going to a very typical school in Salem, Oregon. But what they don't know is some of their classmates have a secret. Salem, Oregon looks like a completely normal town from the outside. Even the people that live there think it's completely normal. But what they don't know is there are several monster families living among them working very hard to conceal their identities. The monster parents are so afraid of their kids being exposed to danger and harassment and prejudice that they make them constantly cover up the very things that make them special in the first place. These poor monsters, just to go to school every day, I mean, I know many of you wake up extra early to pick out perfect outfits, maybe pluck an eyebrow, shave a leg or two, and that seems like a major, major morning routine. But if you were, let's say, Claudine Wolf, who is the daughter of a werewolf, she's got to wax her entire body. Then there's Lala, who is the granddaughter of Dracula, and she has fangs, and the poor girl is a sweetheart, but she cannot smile at school, or else people are gonna see her fangs. So she's got to always act very shy, and she has to smell like this. Monster High follows two main characters, Melody Carver, who is moving from Los Angeles, Beverly Hills, up to Salem, Oregon, because it's better for her lungs because she has asthma. And the other is Frankie Stein, who is Frankenstein's daughter, who was born just 15 days before the novel begins and has been loaded with so much information that she actually has the brain of a 15-year-old. Everything is status quo at Merston High until Melody and Frankie hit the scene. Melody starts dating a descendant of and he doesn't even know it until she kind of lets him know by accident. And Frankie ends up doing something, I cannot tell you what it is, but it is scandalous at the high school dance and it basically ends up exposing her as a monster and oh, it ain't pretty from there. Okay, and then what happens? Now, I am absolutely not supposed to tell you this, but I don't care. Oh. Hold on a second. Hello.